Hello everyone, I'm Alaa Jadi. Welcome to Music Greatness. This is Urban, and for today's lesson, we have Can Be Friends by Trey Songz. It sounds just like this. Alright, what I just played was the main riff that we're going to use for the entire song, except for the section of the bridge. We're playing in the key of B, in the key of B minor, and we're going to start this main riff, playing B minor 9, B, F sharp and A, C sharp, D and F sharp. So three notes on the left, three notes on the right. Then we have A6, A, E, and A, C sharp and F sharp, then G major 7, G, D, G, B, D, F sharp. Still going down, after that we have D over F sharp, F sharp, D, F sharp, A, D, and F sharp. Followed by this E minor 9, E, B, E, G, D, and F sharp. Still playing on E, after that we have E minor 7, changing the notes on the right hand. I have D, G, and B. Then D6, D, A, and D, D, F sharp, and B. Also this, C major 7 with a sharp 11, C, G, C, B, E, and F sharp. And then, to end the main riff, we're going to play two chords, here's the first one, C sharp minus 7, add 11, let's have C sharp, B, E, F sharp. And finally, F sharp 7. Octave F sharp, A sharp, and E. So, let's recap everything. B minor 9, A6, and G major 7. Then D over F sharp, E minor 9, E minor 7, D6, C major 7, sharp 11, then C sharp minor, and F sharp 7. Here it is. 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, So, we're going to start with B minor, playing all the notes on the left at the same time with the two bottom notes on the right hand, so C sharp and D. Then we're going to complete and play F sharp, and apply almost the same pattern, except here we only have one note played with the left, and play F sharp after that. 
and go to G major 7, playing all the notes on the left with the bottom note on the right hand, so B. And from here we're going to play a back and forth between B and D with F sharp. Just like this. After that, we're going to replay G, D, and G with B, followed by D and F sharp. Then quickly play F sharp, D, and F sharp with A, followed by D and F sharp once again. And we're going to land on E minor. E minor 9, so just like G, we're going to play the back and forth between the bottom notes on the right hand, G, and the two top notes, D and F sharp. Playing E, B, and E on the left. Then, still playing on E minor, we have E minor 7, playing D and G on the right hand, then we're going to complete and play B after that. Same logic for D6, D, A and D with the two bottom notes, D and F sharp, followed by the top note, B again. After that, we're playing C major 7, playing a back and forth with B and E and F sharp. Okay. So, if you noticed, before playing C sharp minor, I played one G on my right hand, using my pinky. Then I'm gonna play octave C sharp with B and E. Still playing the back and forth, B and E with F sharp. After that, I have F sharp 7, playing the full chord, followed by G, E and F sharp. And then I'm going to land back on B minor 9. again from E minor 7. All right, here's the entire pattern played slow tempo. Two, three, four, one, Two, three, four. 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 One, two. Three, four. 
Perfect. If you get everything, let's replay that main riff at full speed. 